This is a video of the uh, endometriosis on the diaphragm. This is actually the left side of the diaphragm. It's right under the uh, apex of the heart, or the tip of the heart. It's on the other side of the diaphragm. And you can see the uh, movement of the diaphragm uh, related to the beating of the heart. Um, so this is a small area of endometriosis. We have a very delicate area one that's moving, we have blood vessels, uh, and what this is showing is area vaporization with uh, a carbon-13 CO2 laser, which is appropriate treatment for small areas. And you can see as I'm lasering, um, there's a little bit of endometriosis that comes out, and so we can see the tissue, and, and we'll be able to see when we get rid of all the endometriosis. Um, it's just not easy because the uh, uh, movement of the uh, abdominal wall with the laparoscope makes the uh, laser beam move along with the heart beating you have movement and uh, so still have a little endometriosis next to blood vessels on the uh, to, on the right side of the endo and again, just trying to get as steady as possible. And with all the movement, it's just um, little short bursts of energy. Because we're going to get it. Um, but we don't want to have any complications or side effects. Um, you can see it's just kind of timing and quick bursts of energy with the laser. And uh, we were we're going to get it all. It's just uh, kind of a tedious process and a very delicate, uh, sensitive area. And so we're getting there. We got most of it, but not all of it. We have to get it all. Uh, you can see a little bit of uh, blood from the endometriosis uh, implant there. Again, these are just quick bursts of energy. Uh, this is vaporizing the tissue, so it's eliminating the cells. The heat is applied, the uh, energy is applied so quickly that there's no conduction of heat. Uh, and so we're getting the lesion taken care of without uh, any collateral damage. Okay, here we are. It's all gone.